Hey guys, today I'm going to be reviewing the book um, Becoming Vegan by Brenda Davis. Brenda Davis is a registered dietitian who um, writes a lot of books about vegetarian and vegan nutrition. Now before I start this book review, um, I'm not judging people if you're not thinking of being vegan or you're not on the vegan vegetarian wagon. I'm not judging you at all. I'm just reviewing a book and this is just something that I'm doing myself and that I'm interested in and I read a book about it so I decided to review it so I know that this can be a very um, um, what's the word? It can be a very sensitive topic for people and I just want to, I always want to get that out in the open I just want I don't, I'm not judging you guys if you're not on um, this particular wagon, so to say, so to say. Um, so I'm just going to get that out there. Um, now, this book, if you are thinking of going vegan, plant-based, vegan, plant-based, whatever, I think this should be either the first or second book you should read. Um, it goes into the depths of vegan nutrition, which is a very, um, a lot of people don't understand what they need to eat in order to be healthy as a vegan. Um, and you hear a lot of horror, horror stories in the media of people not eating enough. They, they don't get, you know, they take all of the dairy, milk, and eggs out, but then they don't replace it with things such as tofu or seton or tempeh or soy milk and things like that. And this book has a lot of different, um, like they have a, ch for example, they have a chapter on protein. And there are a lot of things in there that you wouldn't expect have a great deal of protein. Everything has some protein in it because protein are the building blocks of life. Just some things have more protein than others. Like the things I mentioned, uh, tempeh and tofu and seton and beans, those have a lot of protein in it and calcium getting enough calcium and vitamin b12 it goes into all that and each and it's broken down into different chapters and it's also um broken down among um different stages of life so they'll talk about um like average like first they talk about getting all of your minerals and stuff like that and then they talk about um vegan for pregnancy and lactation and growing um, growing children on a vegan diet and the nutrition and things that they should be eating and different ideas and um, and then they go into a um, thing about um, seniors um, in like um, on a vegan diet if they want to embark on that specific train um, and what they need and also vegan athletes if you want to be an athlete and be vegan or plant-based it goes into that as well um, and I, I'm going to keep this book I'm going to keep it and refer to it um, the only thing I didn't like and this is just because I've heard it before is they did go into the a little bit not a lot but they did go into the animal cruelty aspect and the only reason I have a problem with this is because I read it before I read it in the book 
Being Vegan, which I have also reviewed. Um, that was one of the first, I believe that was the first book review I did. And I've heard it before, and I've watched some documentaries. I, I've, just because I've heard it before, I just wish they would have focused on vegan plant-based nutrition. I, I know I'm repeating myself, but some people don't like the word vegan nutrition. Um, plant-based nutrition, because um, I think that is a big a big um, issue for people. Um, a lot of people get into veganism because of animal rights and some of them, not all, not, I'm not saying all people, so please don't get angry, but some people, there's a few, you know, there's a percentage, they don't know what they're doing. And I'm not, I'm not being rude, I'm not trying to be rude, but they just, they don't have the, um, the not the knowledge they haven't looked researched into things and I think if you're gonna embark on this I think you really need to research things and get books from the library and things like that I believe that that's very important um, and again I'm not saying this to be I'm not saying that they're they're stupid or anything I'm not saying that at all um, but it has happened before, um, I've heard stories from friends and things like that, um, so I think this should be the, one of the first books you read, The China Study and then this, and I think you need, to, if you're going to embark on this vegan diet, a plant-based diet, I think you should keep this book. It's really, it goes into total, so many different foods and how much nutri, like how much calcium rice has, how much calcium this has, how much calcium this has, how much protein this has. And it's, it's, um, it's researched very well. It's laid out very well. And I think that this is a really, great book and the only problem I have with it is that they talk about animal cruelty and if I hadn't heard about that from Becoming Vegan and be from other documentaries that I'd watched I probably wouldn't have a problem with it. So um, that was just my review of this book and again if you are not, because I know probably a lot of my viewers are not um, vegetarian or vegan for that matter, um, I'm not judging you. I'm not going to come to your house and kill you or anything. <laughs> and anything, you know, I, most, I mean, all of my, fr a lot of my loved ones are not plant-based. And I love them so much, and my my mother is just the greatest person. She's actually, and she still is an omnivore, let's say, and she's actually tried different um, vegan products that she likes, and she's even tried some before me, and she's like, oh, you need to try this um, back when I was vegetarian. And she is actually, oh, I've tried this, and I hadn't tried it before. So, you know, my mother is just, um, you know, really supportive. And, you know, I don't, we're all on our own path. We're all on our own path. So I, I am not, um, I'm not judging anybody because, we're, we are all doing our own thing, so um, I hope that I hope it comes off in this video because that's that's my that's what I want. I want I'm just this is the stuff I'm interested in. This is the stuff I've been reading, and I just thought I'd review this book and share it with you. Um. So, um. Bye, guys.